Hi everybody! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a review, surprise, surprise, on the Lime Crime, Lime Crime, um, Pink Velveteen. Um, and yeah, let's get cracking. What I'm going to do first of all is I'm going to show you how I put it on my lips. So it comes out in this little doe foot applicator. It's liquid um, and it goes on, glides on like so. Now you need to get it lined up with your lip line. Yeah, so it goes on liquid as you can see um, and it dries, as you can probably see it happening, it dries to a completely matte finish. Um, it does dry quite quickly. Now I have the MUA um, version dupe for this um, in three of the colours and they take quite a long time to dry. So that's kind of a pro and a con um, with this is that it takes less time to dry so um, it's set, set quicker and obviously you can get on with your day quicker whatever um, but the other thing is that if you're not an expert like me as in I'm not an expert not I am an expert clearly if you're not an expert um, it can be quite tricky to kind of get the lines right before you just don't really have enough time to blend it or to tidy it up or whatever. That's it on my lips now. And is it dry? Mm -hmm. uh, it's almost dry, yeah. But as you can tell, whenever I'm doing that, nothing really comes off. So, um, as I said, it dries pretty quickly. Um, the colour, I love the colour, I think it's absolutely gorgeous. Because it's a matte, it's not too, well I think, it's not too like garish and in your face. So I wore it to work yesterday um, and got so many compliments on it as well. So wearing wise, I put it on about half past eight in the morning. Um, I had breakfast whenever I got into work at nine o'clock and I was naughty and had a um, a, sa a sausage sandwich so obviously it's like greasy and uh, there was butter on it and stuff um, I was slightly careful um, but it didn't take it off I didn't have to touch it up at all then I had a drink of water um, through you know the sports cap bottles um, and again there was no problems no issues um, the it did start wearing in the inside of my mouth first of all um, round about after I had my lunch then um, I had to um, take, well not take it off actually um, I with the MUA ones you you have to kind of take it off to reapply because it goes a bit ugh and clumpy um, but with the Lime Crime I've ju I just kind of topped it up um, which was really good because it's handier if you're out, out in the go, you know, you don't ha want to have to start and take off all your lip stuff and put it all back on again. So I just topped it up um, and that was about one o'clock. Because it's like a lip lacquer and it dries and it's matte, it does feel, obviously it's not as comfortable as a gloss would be. Cause you can't kind of go, mmm, um, not that you would do that, but <laughs> you know what I mean. Um, but it doesn't feel overly drying or whatever on the lips. It doesn't like feel like it's sucking the moisture out of your lips or anything. Um, so I wore it to until, until, until I got home about five o'clock and then after that I didn't bother looking in the mirror until I took my makeup off. So one top up, it lasted, what was that, from half eight in the morning to half four. And I think that's pretty good going. Um, for a lip product. Uh, <coughs> sorry, 
frog. Yeah, I think that's um, pretty good going for a lip product, in my opinion. It was slightly more expensive. It was like 11 95 I think, in Cocktail Cosmetics. I'll link it below. Um, but I do think it's well worth it. And I may, at some point, um, when I can afford to, get the um, red velveting. So I really do recommend it if you're somebody who likes pink lips, which I love. So if you're if you're like me and you like pink lips, um, if you like a matte finish, if you like a bright lip but you want it a bit more wearable during the day, and if you want something that lasts a long time um, without having to faff about and take it off and reapply, this is for you. So um, go and get it. So I hope you have enjoyed um, and found this useful. If you have, please give it a big thumbs up. It would really mean the world to me. Hit that subscribe button as well, please and thank you. Um, and let me know if you have tried it, if you've tried the red velveteen and what you think of it down in the comments below. Thank you again. Mm.